Coco, how'd you sleep? How'd you like being in the car? How did you sleep? Good. You? Yeah, we slept pretty well. I had Coco in the car all night, and she liked it. We all just left our campsite on Old Cherry Mountain Road, and now we're headed to go up the Mount Washington Auto Road. We stopped at a natural spring on our way to Mount Washington and are going to fill up our drinking water. just pulled into the Mount Washington Auto Road and Evan is in front of us and Jesse and Liz are behind us. So just drive up and drive but make sure you're in first gear all the way down okay? Okay. Restrooms are right up ahead if you need them there's a visitor center on the top. Okay. We just passed the 4,000 feet mark. What'd you think of the drive, Bob? Yeah. <laughs> How long do you think the line will take? Yeah. Magnet for us. Looks good. I like it. Oh, it was cute. And I got a little sticker for my water bottle too. See ya. It's nice and warm in here. Did you have a fun time at the summit? Yeah, it was nice. Can you tell us about it a little bit? It was very crowded at the top. We had a nice, clear and sunny summit. We took our picture by the top of Mount Washington and there were a lot of people in line. Coco, what did you think about it? We just made it back down from going up Mount Washington and it's already a lot warmer down here. We're now headed to the picnic area to have lunch. We're going to this place called the Dolly Cop 
picnic area. enough to get you out there like yeah well we were scared yeah. yeah we just had lunch we had tacos for lunch and now we're going to glen ellis falls so we're driving south again we didn't end up stopping at glen ellis falls because it was so busy we couldn't even find an improper place to park we just went into this cute little country store and we got these candies that are called need ham. I got a maple one and Josh got an espresso one, so we'll have to see how they are. We just had the candies and they were pretty good, but they're a little too sweet and we decided we don't think we would get them again. We decided to go back to Littleton and we're gonna check out a dog friendly brewery called Schilling before we go find a campsite for the night. Here you go. Hey. It's Sunday, July 3rd, and we're currently 20 minutes away from a possible free campsite that's right on the Connecticut River, right along the Vermont, New Hampshire border. And we are hoping that no one is there because from what we've seen, it is a very small site. We just checked out the free campsite and it looks like it's private land, so we've decided to not stay there. We just did some research and we found this place called Getaway Mountain and Campground, three miles away from where we are. And that's where we're headed to see if we can get a site for tonight. This is quite the experience. Oh, we're gonna be in the golf cart races. Oh my God, look at this one. Look at this one. I like this one. So as you can see, we didn't stop at that campground. We didn't have a golf cart and- We weren't drunk we enough. We weren't drunk enough to <laughs> stop there. Now we're headed back to Vermont, uh, Forest Route 71, and we're gonna stay at a, in a different section than the spot we stayed at on Thursday. In order to get us through, we decided to get peanut M&Ms while we got gas. How are they coming? Good. Does she not want to get out? I don't think so. Coco, what are you doing? Do you like it in here? She must. It's like warm in there. 